it's been awesome, you know, training's been good, intense. Um, the, the levels have picked up every day since we, be, uh, since we first got here, so, you know, everyone's ripping in, trying to get themselves in good shape, ready for the World Cup. You know, I'm looking forward to going for Sol to Salford and new challenges, and, you know, I can't wait to get there and, and uh, play our first, you know, our first friendly at, at, the, at my home stadium. And your new club teammate, you've been rooming with him, Rangi Chase, he's been taking you down to the gym first thing in the morning. How have you found that? Yeah, he's had me up um, seven o'clock down at the gym for half seven. Um, it's been funny here yeah, with, uh, with Gerald and um, looking forward to playing with him at Salford next year. It's good, it's good for the uh, community, especially for the kids, you know. Uh, it's a good initiative for them to, to let them in free, to come and see their stars playing, their favourite players, you know. for. They get to see the likes of the Australian players over, uh, that have come over as well, like the, the Burgess boys and um, James Graham's back in his home soil. And what can we expect from Italy? Because they, they've made some improvements to their squad. Um, you can expect for many countries it's going to be a tough game. You know, when people play for their country, um, you know they put everything out on the field. So they've got some class players there. It's going to be hard. It's going to be a hard game, but uh, not only for us, but it's going to be a hard game for them as well.